and that is why the highest priority should be given for a long term result for a long term experience to seek and make seeking a high priority in life and what should you seek you seek what is going to be there with you after this body dies to only seek things that are going to be in this body is a very temporary uh, seeking and you get very temporary results and when you die you regret why you spent all your time seeking for things that are not going to go with you we make plans for years ahead old people my age and even older sometimes are making plans for the next 10 years 20 years we are making this investment and something will come to us now we are planning to go and we set up a house somewhere and next next year next month sometime next day they are dead and they are making plans as if they'll be here forever and what happens at the time of death nothing goes with us none of those relations none of those friendships none of those things none of those cars and boats and houses none of the jewelry that we collect none of the clothes nothing goes with us and we see we are leaving everything behind and we regret why we thought that was going to be our permanent possession there is no permanence in the things around us in the physical plane there is no permanence in the things around us anywhere in this creation except what we can find in immortality which is in our life force in our souls in that which is not going to die and we should give priority to that on a daily basis that is why meditation has been recommended to be a daily ritual why because it reminds you again and again what your priority in life should be getting together like in meetings like these which we in india call satsangs satsangs means the company of the truth here we share truth the truth about ourselves the truth about the physical life the truth about the physical universe sat means truth sang means company the company of the truth is what we gather when we meet together it's very important my own master the great master azur maharaj baba sawan singh used to say that satsang is like a fence around our ultimate real property which is our soul and our life force it's a fence to prevent the mind from bringing outside forces to attack us to bring the negativity of this universe to bring to us so satsang is as important as meditation and both are supposed to be reminders of what is highly important in our life to which we should give priority so i'm glad <clears throat> from time to time we get a chance to get together and share the truth